Uh, on the rock, on the rock. I'm gonna nade it. Oh boy. This guy just went through me? Actually, honey mustard's all right. Isn't it Dijon that I don't like? I think I, I I'm think whenever I think of honey mustard, I'm thinking of Dijon a lot of the time. Dijon's just one of those ones I can't really understand. Whoa, Mickey Mouse! I'll give you some brown sugar. I'll give you some brown sugar. That's funny. <laughs> that's, that's really good. I love the bite Dijon has. Yeah. Sometimes I just want to eat something and enjoy it instead of getting bit though, you know? Call me old fashioned. The whole biting thing is a little too much when it comes to my food biting back. <laughs> like I should be the one biting. Oh, that was such an easy kill. He got in. I feel like one went in here. We know one went up top. Blue cheese has the same appeal. Yeah, like no appeal. I agree. Blue cheese is one of those things that people eat to upset others. Like, oh, but blue cheese with my buffalo wings. I'm like, oh, that's a great way to ruin buffalo wings, man. Like, what the hey? Like, I'm down with a lot of cheeses. I'll eat a variety. You put a charcuterie board in front of me, I'm happy, happy Hallie. But blue cheese just doesn't seem like it's in the same category as the other delicious cheeses. Like, like if you had any cheese to choose from, you like chose the worst one. <laughs> But, I have said in the past, maybe the blue cheese I've tried wasn't good blue cheese, or like it was just like, poorly prepared. I don't know. Because there's a lot of things I've come uh, around on since my youth that I hated. One, was pickled beets. Those things are delicious! What the heck was I thinking? I thought for so long, like, oh, would you like some beets? Oh, no, thank you. I prefer, uh, I prefer pickles. But man, I, I definitely get down on some pickle beets right now. That's another thing I thought I didn't like. You have no throwables. Now I have one now! Well... Howard. I don't even think that's the guy. What the hell is he shooting windows for? Sir, you're missing a helmet. Oh no, we got We're close, sorry. I'm getting dressed. I'm Nike. 
Oh my gosh, you're trying to see my wiener? Hey guys, he's trying to see my wiener. Oh frick. Okay. Oh my god, I can't see. Oh, now you give me some privacy. Ouch. He's trying to see my wing. It actually seemed like he was like, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I had no idea. I had no idea you were getting dressed. It was actually kind of his uh, movement there. So I kind of framed him. Interesting push against a shotgun. So on uh, EU, I've got to be the aggressor. If I'm uh, holding, uh, I get sh shotgun before they're on my screen. So in that case, I was like, well, this is my chance to be the aggressor. In, like in Canada, where instead of eating ice cream, you can eat frozen whale fat. It's a delicacy there. Jeez Louise. Can't wait to get killed while skinning my Aston Martin. Ooh. Oh my gosh, something's under my wheels. Oh my gosh, what's under my wheels? My goodness! That a pothole? He doesn't know. He doesn't know he's about to die. <laughs> he's about to get killed in the back. He's about to get killed in the back. I said he's about to get killed in the back. A back attack. That guy never dies. He's just sit, standing there sitting at me. There's a dude like right on the other side of the building from him. Jeez, it took long enough. Oh my gosh. What the? Is Chaco on today? Very good question. I haven't talked to Chaco, but I believe he takes Saturdays off. Uh, make sure to come back here anytime you need to know about Chaco's status. Chaco makes sure to tell me every morning what his uh, schedule is looking like. Um, and also Chaco's the competition, so I am going to lie sometimes to make sure you guys stay here and don't watch Chaco over me, okay? He is competition. He is the Walmart. I am the little mom and pop store, okay? And you just asked if Walmart was open, and I don't appreciate it. Uh, uh, I'm just joking. <laughs> Thought you were Costco? Maybe when maybe when TSM picked me up. Maybe maybe around that time it was a little bit Costco. Totally silly talking about that, guys. Chaco's amazing. I wouldn't uh, I wouldn't want you guys to 
ever choose me over him. Whatever you guys are enjoying, I'm just happy to be here. Oh, oh, oh. Fixed up the old uh, Ryan. Um, Chalk has done a ton for me. In the streaming game, there's a lot of people that uh, that you collab with, that you play with, that you uh, become friends with. I can help you on your journey, and, and Chaco's uh, definitely one of the big streamers that, that I've been introduced to so many new people through him, so. I, uh, I'm very grateful to Chaco. Like, there's been a lot of, lot of instances, like, through Doc, very early on, Moondai. Um, people like Smack. Smack would probably one of the earliest influences him, um, earlier, maybe before that, Calendale. There's a lot of people on my journey that uh, uh, that helped me out, and there's some that claim that they they helped me out when they <laughs> were just like. I had one guy come in just say like he was like the reason why I was able to take off. He would do like raids. <laughs> I'm not even getting names. This is back in the day. He probably had like a good like 60, 70 viewers. Like he's doing well, but he would do raids where he would do multiple raids middle of his stream there was no like rating or like hosting options uh back then what you would do is just like go in and be like hey, raid 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 everybody type raid or whatever the, the sign was um just like to send over your viewers at the end of your stream but he was just doing midstream and be like okay do a raid on this person okay and then come back <laughs> then they would come back and then they would go and they would raid another person and then like, okay, come back. <laughs> they're like, just like, they're, they're like midway through the stream, they would just go raid people, make a bunch of noise. And then they would all come back to his channel. They would hit another channel with it. Then they'd come back to his channel. Like it wasn't like the idea of raids at all or hosts. Like, uh, it was just kind of, it was kind of funny, but that person, that person claimed to have like a big uh, influence on, on my, uh, my streaming career and it kind of irked me I was like no dude like there's real people that help me out there's like people that legitimately help me get to where I am I don't even remember killing this guy did I kill this guy? am I losing my marbles? for subscribing to my friend Howie buddy uh, well, it just straight up says unknown what the heck who is that is that one of you guys are you pranking me don't prank me bro oh shoot now I just can confirm they know that my number Ah, oh, heck, it was time for a new number anyways. The tax man keeps calling. Hey, we, we need we need your tax funds. Like, no, I need my tax funds. I need another pool. Hmm, who do we who do we kill? Who do we kill first? Neither. Oh my gosh. That seems about right, eh, chat? Boom! Oh, jeez. Do we drive this? Like, what can we do? By shape, we find Hollywood Bob. Now, speaking of energy, Bob's got energy for days. I've never gone into like a Bob stream and he's not like on like just being fun and energetic and entertaining. I really uh, commend him on that because I know how, but, like he does long streams too. It's not like it's just like an action packed two hours.
All right, four left. I think there was somebody closer, but maybe it's that dead body. Mm. Oh. My bunny scared me, man. There's special skins that the SLR does for the crates. It's like a little bunny rabbit on top of the box. It looked like a player looking over the hill. All right, I think I did my part in getting rid of players. Maybe these guys could kill some. Maybe, perhaps. Okay. Okay. Ask for it. I don't know what to do here, though. I almost have to just, like, take a... Ch 